Daniel Knobloch, Associate Professor in the Department of Youth Development and Agriculture Education. Okay. Studying um, learner-centered teaching as a way to engage students in uh, typically classroom environments. I can also do um, in community-based environments as well. I was trained to be a teacher and so I taught agricultural sciences to middle school and high school students for seven years. Um, to be an engaging teacher is much more complicated than what it appears like it would be on the other side of the desk as a student. I, en I enjoy learning by doing and, and being involved in projects and activities and, and cooperative learning activities, but I was not necessarily taught how to do that uh, when I was trained to be a teacher. So I, in short, struggled to become an engaging teacher in my first two or three years. Learner-centered teaching is when you focus your teaching strategies by starting with what are the needs of the learner. So if we can make learning more engaging um, in the classroom setting, then you'll have students that will be more motivated, they'll learn more, and they'll also understand the relevance of, of why they're learning the content and concepts so that they'll be more prepared for their careers in the real world. I collaborate with a lot of different professors. Um, some of them are content experts, so they would be professors that teach. And for example, in, in a, an example that we're currently working on is with educational games. Um, so we also have information technology specialists, educational gamers, graphic designers. So it, it has become a, a large collaborative project of almost 20 people that are participating. So what, we, uh, what we have done with this project is we've identified, working with the professors in the areas of plant science, food science, and animal sciences who teach introductory courses. We have asked them to identify the most difficult science concepts that freshman, sophomore level students in colleges um, or in their college classes would, would struggle learning. And so based upon evidence, exam scores, uh, they helped us um, identify what those difficult science concepts were. They prioritized them into the one they felt would be most beneficial to now uh, develop an educational game so that would, um, that would help scaffold learning, create some structure to learning in an interactive way so that students can learn about a difficult science concept. Most of my research benefits um, undergraduate education. And so many of the professors are teaching undergraduate courses. And so agriculture provides not only a wonderful career opportunity for students, but also a great way to learn science, technology, engineering, and mathematics in a context. I love people. I love to develop people uh, or develop their capacity, if you will, uh, to be able to help others. We need more students that understand agriculture, more students that understand science, and if we can do a better job of helping them, then I think we'll have a better place to live.